So in this video, I'm going to be looking at X Transbots uh, MMVI6 Warrior Boost, which is of course their take on a G1 wind charger. And here's the box. I picked this up from Primetime Toys, and I'll put a link down there. Uh, this is what he looks like in these various modes. We've got a tech spec sheet. Yeah, nice box. Bringing him out of the box, he comes with some instructions and a nice firm collector's card. He has his, uh, he attaches it to one of his, uh, it comes out one of the cartoon episodes, I cannot remember what it does, I think it's something to do with magnets maybe. He has a gun. He has a toy face and what looks to be, I'm not sure, maybe something to do with his head? Or maybe I'll figure it out when he's in robot mode. All right, let's look at the chap himself. He looks quite lovely, really. Uh, Transam, I think. I'd guess that you could probably store some of these guns and stuff under there. Looks like you should be able to. That's, um, I've got a new light, so there's too much in the way for me to fiddle. <laughs> Just, yay. Um, it feels like that if I hadn't have cut my nails, the lights would come up. Oh yeah, pop-up headlights. Anyway, I remember being a kid and I always wanted a car with pop-up headlights. But... He looks quite lovely, really. Um, yeah, that is a nice looking car mode. Right, I'm gonna see if there is any storage one moment. So let's get one thing clear straight off the bat. The transformation for this guy is not fun. It is, it's a, it's a horror show. Um, arms, legs and head all have bits where you feel like you, you're breaking it and that there's actually a snap sort of sound when you pull the head back and you just sort of makes you go um, that said here he is um, and he looks great looks really really good really really like him uh, yeah, articulation, arms go all the way around, he can sort of indicate that he wants a cuddle, head goes around, it seems by the way that there's two colour versions of him, because but I had to cheat, I had to use a, a video and I went to MGO's site, he's got this, he's got a lot more blue in him, so I believe, uh, now looking at the box, it actually says on it teal so this is the teal version so this is uh, I believe the cartoon version um, anyway I'm digressing uh, waist yes a bit, a bit weird looking but still has a waist uh, you've got little red flaps there that I suddenly have a feeling that I should have put somewhere but ugh. Uh, so that can come forward, backwards, out, Ooh. 90 at the knee. I don't really want to see if there's any, this, this assembly here is really not fun. <laughs> but yeah, if I had the money, he's one of the figures that if I had the money, I would have two of him. So I could have one in vehicle and one in robot and never have to transform him. I think that's the goal with this guy is just to, just not transforming him ever because it's really not. It, it's just, I can't express how much not fun it is. I mentioned this little gray bit here and it looks like it's just a spare bit for the back of his head. Don't know why you want a spare bit of head, but you know, 
Oh, I suppose it just clips. You can just put the... Oh, what you can't see is I'm fiddling with this off camera. You can put that there and put it together. <laughs> this is, these are the troubles I have. I can't handle tiny, tiny, tiny things, which is ironic, really. But I'm not telling you why. Um, holding his weapons. Again, I'm just doing this off camera. Maybe I'll remember to edit this bit out. Maybe I won't. Who knows? Uh, holds them very nicely. Very nicely indeed. So it's, it's it's such a it's such a funny figure. I love this figure, and I'm terrified of this figure. And it is a fantastic wind charger. And look at him. He just he looks the part. And he's got because he's so small, he's got quite a bit of weight to him. He's got die cast in his feet, uh, die cast in his body. Yeah, there's quite a bit of die cast. Um, once he's together, I've got very few issues. The only issue I do have is with his left forearm, this bit. Uh, a strong breeze seems to undo it. But other than that, he looks the part, he acts the part. Um, I'm dreading, dreading transforming him ever again. It is that terrifying. But he's really cool. So yeah, he has to get a thumbs up. Robots. So in this video, I'm going to be looking at tr trans... Oh, for God's sake.